Yeah. The tuna, I'll say, is this a new tuna that you've got here, the uh, triple stick? The triple stick is an updated tuna. So yeah. it's an updated tuna from what was the old 290 Lee. Uh, the 290 Lee offers the 3D and 3D high definition TV. Yeah. Uh, the 292, which is what we've got here today, obviously, 3D is 3D high definition and also cable support as well. Right. So you've got DVC, T2. And DVC. Right. Yeah. Um, so in the, in the same interface, the same user quality, the same levels of support, yeah. software, so capturing your content onto your PC. Yeah. Still includes the disc down TV software as well, which allows you to stream your content throughout the home. Okay, sorry, just so explain to me that, yeah, because that is quite an interesting feature. So what's, what can you so do? You've got, within the software, I actually don't have it working here at the moment, but within the software that comes in with the pack itself, is the ability for you to stream the content from your computer way out the home. Right. So you can connect, so for argument, so you're sitting with a tablet in the front room, connect via browser into your PC and then stream your content. Right. So somebody else will be behind the home and be sitting in for maybe a bit more luxury if you like. Yeah. And uh, yeah, watch the same content. Yeah, that's great because I mean, quite often where your aerial wire comes into your home is not where you want to sit and watch TV. That's right. Well, if you want to watch it somewhere else, uh, yeah. um, you can access the pre recorded content as well. So again, it really is if you can control your content just a little bit better. Yeah. The distant TV software included. And would that work over, you say, over a tablet? So could you go from an, an iOS for, for an iPad or from an Android tablet? Could you yeah, go? It's, it's browser based. Yeah. So it's not app driven or anything. So yeah. as long as you've got your obviously browser on your tablet. Yeah. Device, that's yeah. really neat. And that's just through this little tuner here. That's the, yeah. yeah. Actually, sorry, the uh, 292E is the new part number for yeah. the hardware. It's the world's only USB 3D high definition stick. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we've made slight tweaks to it, but it's still a great. Yeah, because that's the, you see a lot of stick USB tuners that are just DVT. It's the it's the T2 that you're going to do if you're going to build a media center. You really want that. That's right. The media center, absolutely. And we also find that a lot of second generation users, people that are coming back, you know, they've had a tuner for a few years. Yeah. They come back. Yeah, we want to go high definition now. Yeah. And it obviously depends on your home and, and how, how your life is. But for me, I'm constantly getting kicked out of my front room by my children. Yeah. So come Champions League football night, I can go sit in front of the yeah. PC or somewhere else and watch it high definition. So that's excellent. Yeah. Well. Excellent. And um, what's the pre retail price on those? Uh, retail price. We've actually improved that as well. So retail price is forty nine ninety nine. Right. So for forty nine quid, and you you can turn your PC into a media center, preview HD machine. Excellent. Thanks for that. Okay. So this one here. What, uh, for tablets? Yeah, so it's an, it's an Android TV plug and play connection, so I don't know if you can see that clearly or not. What we're looking at here is an Android tablet. Our unit via mini USB plugs directly into the device. And then what you're looking at here is a free view aerial, so built in here is a free view television tuner. And really the idea behind this product is it allows you to watch and record your free view TV content but without using your 3G data. Yeah. Um, and that's quite important obviously for a lot of people that are watching TV on the go. One of the big concerns is how much data am I using? Yeah. This is a one-time purchase and the show price is $39.99. Standard SRP is $49.99. It's a one-time purchase to allow you to watch your free view content. Yeah. That'd be quite good there. You give your kids that and they can stick it on the tablet while you're on a journey, long journey right. and you're not streaming over your data. Yeah. Yeah. And that's perfect. Last year, as I mentioned, last year uh, on a trip I went on, uh, we actually preloaded from, we recorded some content from the BBC. Over three weeks they showed the Pirates of the Caribbean films. Three weeks in a row we recorded content to a tablet and when it obviously started raining yeah. when I was camping, yeah. <laughs> we had something to watch. Oh, that's excellent. Uh, so related to that, then, the one you just showed me before, this is quite interesting. This the, It's kind of a similar thing but more for like I guess if you've got your own collection of movies. Yeah, so, so instead of whereas the Android TV would, would be giving you free view television, this device is a portable extra storage for your Android or your Apple product. So this would require you to preload your content onto an SD card up yeah. to 128 gig. Um, we actually supplied a product without SD card in because most of us have got an SD card at home somewhere. So preload content on be it music, photos, videos, you can even put business presentations and documents onto it. Product. This has its own Wi-Fi connection, so you connect to that via your tablet or your mobile device. And then from there, you can transfer data backwards and forwards, or play data, play um, music, whatever the content is from the SD card, you can play on your mobile device. Uh, five people can connect to 
the same time, so you can have different people accessing different content at the same time. But it really, it's a, it's a neat device. It gives you the ability to control a little bit better the content. Do I want to preload content to my phone? Maybe not. I can load it on here and take it with me. Um, and I've still got it with me, but I don't have Yeah, it. especially handy if you've got a 16 gig iPad and your kids want loads of movies on there, you can just stack it up. Yeah. And that's where it really does come in. Yeah. 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 Excellent. Nice and simple. Here. I'll give you my analogy because the best way to describe it. I bought a, a, a docking station for an iPhone 4 way back and then you know, a year later bought an iPhone 5. Lovely docking station, now pretty much no good to me. Yeah. It wasn't wireless, it wasn't Bluetooth. This little dongle here, by connecting to the aux in of a docking station, makes it a wireless music player. So now that docking station that I really didn't have a lot of use for anymore has become a oh, I see. Right, wireless yeah. unit. So now in my kitchen at home I can stand it with my iPhone, and my children can use their mobile devices, connect via Bluetooth and just play your content back. So this speaker now is playing content from my iPhone. Yeah. Uh, three or more people can connect to this device, so at a party or something you can have different people playing different music. NFC connectivity as well, so it's nice and simple to connect. Works via aux in, so if your speaker or device has got an aux in, this is going to do the same job for you. Yeah. So I actually have it working in my car as well, because I've got aux in the car, but it's not a Bluetooth system. Yeah. Oh, that's a really nice device. I mean, you, if you've got a decent hi-fi setup, yeah. it's separate, so that's what I've got. And um, you want to network enable it or whatever, that, that's a nice check. Yeah. So you just add the device. I mean, it's, it's USB chargeable, battery yeah. life is going to give you... I mean, for the unit I use in the car, it lasts over between seven and ten days. Mm. So it's a really strong battery life as well. But as you can see, this is now playing wireless content. That's really good. So, so what's the three, price of that? This one is $29.99. Yeah. Um, so really, yeah, well, it's a difficult tagline, but really it brings light back into some old... Yeah. You know, I think I had a quick look around my house. It's perfect for my room in the kitchen, but actually four speakers in my house had an aux in. Yeah. Which now could be Wi-Fi players. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. That's excellent.